Crestwood here, October 12th, 2021, 10.30 a.m. Once again, I wake up after not getting much sleep last night to be in shocks in the side of my head, in the back of my head, getting movement and crawling in my neck, for fuck's sakes. There is shit inside of me that was put into me and it is being done compliments of OPP Spencer Mills, compliments of Staff Sergeant Chief Now Gone, Robert Kane, Robert Lucas, Shannon Cork, Stacy, a mental health worker, Shelley Huffington. You speak police crimes, you will end up paying. You will end up being injured, tortured, brain damaged, lobotomized, Sex assaulted, lied about, cover ups, time buying, arrest refusals. And then when you try to get help and to save your life, you will be turned into a criminal by the ones helping, committing, and covering felony crimes with OPP, the two mental health workers with William Billy Woldridge of 149 Centre Street North, Napanee, Ontario, Blair Hardy, they're using remote neuro monitoring. I am going through identity theft. I've been skull deformed. I've been brain fucked. And it can all be 100% proven. Right now as I'm doing this, I'm getting clicking in the left side of my temple area and in my ear. Every time I talk, it's like it's something is typing. I am being used for illegal surveillance for OPP through remote narrow monitoring. I have it on me 24-7, William Billy Woldridge broadcasting through me, plus other shit me. This is how I'm being deformed. This is how I'm being mentally fucked up. And it can all be 100% proven. No surgeries, no neurological problems. But I am being injured and now I cannot prove it because it is a crime for me to prove that I am being injured and who it's being done by and how. I try to get help to save my life. It is now a criminal offense. Because the ones doing it need to keep it covered up to get away with it. There you go, Waldridge, as you can see, and everybody else. My identity theft that I've been talking about is going to happen since 2019, that this was the outcome, is coming to fruition more and more and more. William Waldridge, along with everyone else, is guilty of homicide in the first degree against my mother. They need to be arrested. They need to face criminal felony charges for the crimes that they are committing. They are using their badges, they are using positions, they are using credentials to cover it up and get away with it. And every single time I'm talking right now, I'm getting clicking right here in my temple area and in my left ear. I have no feeling on my right side of my head. <coughs> As you can see, there's been more skull deforming, there's been differences in my skull and it can be proven from now till before. I'm being turned into a fucking vegetable. I'm being turned into William Aldridge. I'm being injured. I'm a middle-aged man, and now I can't even fucking get help to prove my injuries and the crimes that are taking place with me because it is here in Napanee, because it is through OPP, and because of the way they are doing it with William Aldridge and with Blair Hardy and others who are involved in helping cover it up since 2019 because I spoke of police crimes, all this, including my sex assaults and my mother being murdered for revenge, and I will not be proven wrong, taking out William Aldridge's prisoner tracking, putting it onto me for stalking, framing part of this crime. I will not be proven wrong. These criminals now have my blood and my piss they can use to frame me. They have my signature, they can use it for forgery, they can use it for fraud, they can use it for a number of things. They will have my prints, they can use it for other 
framing against me and for other crimes. They are not a, they are not above or below doing it. They've proven that they are nothing but terrorists. They will do everything they have to do to prevent their arrest and from a get note from their crimes that they are committing. Of course they will. And I am the pawn that they are using to do it. Trying to turn me into a fucking vegetable. All this can be proven, including skull deforming and everything else can 100% be medically proven. But I will now be called, I will now be put in jail if I try to get help. So, and that's what this is about because the ones involved holding their positions do not want to go to jail. Do not want it found out that they are committing these crimes through their positions, through their credentials, through their badges. <clears throat> Human sex trade, slavery, trafficking, children and adults, sex assaults, drug trafficking, and a lot of other crimes. And they're sitting back getting away with it. While everybody else is paying for what they are doing. Families of murder, families of murder and a missing. I would suggest you check the. I would suggest you talk, check the cops because they are involved and they know that they can do it and get away with homicides. Firstwood, love all, hate none, and no feeling in my head at all. So congratulations. You're getting away with this and being me being prevented from getting help now <laughs> makes it even easier for you. Serious, serious skull deforming, serious changes in the shape and size of my head, my face. My face is being pushed out while the back of my head is getting flatter. <laughs> and then other times where I had pictures where it's completely round. Like, what the fuck? No surgeries. So, you know, and damages can be proven. I have CT scans that can prove before till now. So... <laughs> Christ would love all, hate none, be safe, take this serious, watch yourselves, watch your children because they're seen as money makers, they're seen as somebody they can traffic as well as parents that they can murder while they injure, torture, sex assaults you, lie about you, do everything possible to get out of arrest and a charging for the crimes that they are committing. They will criminalize you to get away with the crimes that they are committing. Christ would Love all, hate none, just to get out of the crimes that they are committing. So, you're getting away with this and you're proving it 100%. <coughs> you speak up and try to save lives in Napanee, your life will be taken one way or another. This is about revenge on me. I will not be proven wrong. 